Hi, my name is Greg Pallia. I'm with Wasp Roofing Systems and welcome to another edition of Whiteboard Roofing. In today's episode, we're gonna talk about torch down roofs. I know they're super old. But we're gonna talk about how you repair them, what options you have, and what you should do uh, going forward. Um, so the first thing uh, any commercial roofing contractor is gonna do, they're gonna to wanna to come out and look at your roof. They're gonna look at the seams. They're gonna ask you how many plies you have. Um, how much of the insulation is wet. They may pull some core samples just to get an idea of what's currently going on with your torch down roof. And then based on those, that information, they can give you the best recommendations going forward. Um, maybe you're wondering what repair options uh, you have. Um, certainly this all comes down to how many roofing systems you already have installed. So if you have one roofing system or less installed, um, you can add anything you want over top of that because uh, per building code, you can have a maximum of two roofs, but if you already have two roofing systems on top, um, you're going to be forced to remove at least one roofing system, no matter how good a condition the top is already. Um, or you can do what's called a coating system, which is not really considered a roofing system, it's considered roof maintenance, but basically it's like putting a super engineered paint over what you already have. Like I said, it's not considered a roof system. Um, it helps you avoid that complete roof tear off. So that's one option you might consider out there. Um, other people have asked, you know, what are the costs and warranties of these other roofing systems? Say you only have one roofing system, like your torch down is your only roofing system out there. You can put whatever you want on top of that. You could do TPO, EPDM, which the single pies are very popular. You could spray foam the roof if you're looking, you know, to, you know, maybe you want to do some changes in your sloping to avoid ponding water, or you want to add some R value or you want a renewable roof, you might lean towards spray foam, or you can lean towards a coating system um, as well. Um, the costs, coating system is two to four dollars a square foot. Um, certainly the prices have gone up with today's storages that have gone on. Uh, foam roof is four to six dollars a square foot. Um, same with all the single plies, so TPO and EPDM are usually around four to six dollars a square foot. And then a new torch down roof, um, considering there's not really any contractors that really do them, um, the pricing is just very expensive out there. It's just, it's a safety hazard. You got an open flame on a roof. Uh, it takes a lot of time to do that. Um, I, I, don't, I don't know how much they are per square foot, um, but I could almost promise you they're more expensive than the other roofing systems uh, talked about. And then really, if you have a torch down roof right now that needs repair, what should you do right now? Um, really, I would contact at least three different commercial roofing contractors and probably ones that do different roofing systems as well. Get a single ply guy, get a spray foam guy, Get a coating system guy, um, and if you can find a torch down guy, get him too. Get him on your roof, have him assess what's going on, let him tell you what repair options they're gonna do and the costs, and then weigh out the options that way. That way you're not only comparing cost of what the system does, but you're also comparing what will happen in the future. Like for example, a lot of people pick spray foam because it's easy to you know, change the slope because they already have ponding water and they're going to save in future energy costs, you know, which is a great plus that other systems can't, can't say. Um, so that's really it for today. I know torch down roofs are really old, uh, but you need them repaired. You don't want water coming to your building. So hopefully you learned at least one thing new today, and I will see you next time. Thank you.